everybody, it's Gina, and today I'm actually in the kitchen, and I am cooking something for dinner tonight. Uh, tonight, we are having a very simple meal. What are we having, you ask? Chili dogs. So, I have these. These are the uncured beef franks. Uh, it's part view. That is uh, Aldi's brand. So, if you want to know where I got that, I got them at Aldi. Um, also, we have got these, the Checkers and Rallies Famous uh, Seasoned Fries. Let me tell y'all, I like, I like this kind of style of a French fry. You know, I like the seasonings real well. Now, on my countertop behind me, I do have, I have one of them tiny little forming grills that ain't big enough to... It's like big enough for one person and stuff, really. Honestly, it's big enough for one. I have to cook for more than one person. Also, what do we have? We've got chili with beans and meat. Because con carne means with meat. For those of y'all that may not know that. Um, I'm sure most of y'all do. I, I know just enough Spanish to kind of get myself into trouble. Anywho. Now, of course, the fries, you can get those at Dollar General. That's where I got mine. The chili came from the LDS Bishop Storehouse. Uh, as I said, the um, hot dogs or franks came from... The uh, local Aldi here, and we're just cooking that like the instructions say. Also, on my countertop behind me, I have ketchup, mustard, um, relish, and chopped up onions so that people can make themselves a decent hot dog. I made with this is a pack of eight hot dogs, and there were. So I took out four of them, took out half, and stuff. I figure two is more than ample for both of us. We don't need more than that. So, uh, basically, you know, this is showing y'all a lot of nights. You know, people don't always want to come home and cook gourmet dinners. And a lot of y'all with real young kids will understand what I'm saying when I say this. Sometimes your kids will eat a hot dog or macaroni and cheese. You know? That, that Some days you have to kind of occasionally give in and give them something. You can always get turkey eggs. They're healthy as well. Um, and stuff, they're uh, got a lot less fat and calories and stuff. And you can even get mac and cheese now that's got veggies in it and stuff like in the noodles or whatever. So, your kids wouldn't even know that they're eating the vegetables. They think they're eating mac and cheese. You know. So, you, you just fool them sometimes. Now, not always. You, you can get away with that when they're real little. But by the time they get to be about school age, they should be eating vegetables and eating them fairly well and stuff. Of course, we didn't get much choice growing up stuff. My mama just made what she had to make with and just sit down and eat it and be quiet about it. Seriously, y'all. Some of y'all had old school moms, too. I know y'all did. Moms that said y'all ain't getting up from this table until you finish your vegetables. Now, my mom wasn't real horrible, horrible about that. My mom was really decent about that. But we got started eating vegetables when we were real, real little. And because we were used to having vegetables on our plate, by the time we got to be school age, we would eat vegetables that a lot of other children wouldn't eat, like broccoli or tomatoes and you know things like that olives and that kind of stuff that you know a lot of other kids weren't eating and stuff and we were like oh this is good 
the only thing I've ever found that, well, there's certain things I don't want to try because I don't know that I'd like them. But as far as um, stuff that I just, I, I would prefer not to eat llama beans. That's pretty much the ones that I can think of. Lima beans is it. Prefer not to eat those. Anyway. So I just thought I would let y'all see real quick what was on the menu tonight at Gina's house. Because I know some of y'all will be making stuff like this through the week. You know, for weeknight dinners. A lot of times on Saturday or Sunday, you, you know, I understand a lot of you working folks cook a little bit more on the weekends than you do during the week and stuff. But, um, yeah, I mean, you know, just another weeknight dinner at my house. But anyway, I will see you all in the next video. If you haven't already, click like, subscribe, and as always, leave me a comment in the comment section down below. Bye-bye.